been watching this video. This is Sarah Sullivan. You've either been on my list or potentially following me on Facebook for quite some time. We've been friends or some form or another, and I've got a little message to share with you. Huh. Okay, so one of the things that I'm very curious to um, connect with you on is what does it feel like when a woman you love, whether it be a romantic woman or your mother or a, a daughter or a sibling or a coworker, like what does it feel like when a woman in your life is absolutely um, miserable, <laughs> right? When she's not happy, when she's caught in a, a mode where she's like got to make everything happen and every little detail counts. Like how does that make you feel? If you're like most men I know, probably not so good and you feel helpless and you want to do what you can to help but really what you want to do is just kind of run into your man cave and hang out and avoid the um, the storm of that woman and just you know hide away we all know that doesn't necessarily help and the more you can be helpful to that woman in that moment the more that sometimes mostly but not always you can actually avoid uh, a big blow up or a big meltdown. But we all know what it, what it feels like to be on the other side of that. And I've seen it and I've been the woman who has really been that really unhappy woman really just projecting onto my man and there's nothing he can do to make it right. So here's, I've got a little invitation for you. I've been working with women for more than a decade. My whole mission in life is to help women to become more connected to the divine feminine essence so that they can actually live happier, more well-rounded, more healthier lives. Now, that sounds like a lot of blah, 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 and it can be because really we women talk a lot about this whole feminine principle stuff, um, but it's confused. There's a confusion around what that actually means in the world, and it's caused a lot of issues. However, point being, is that my, my truest mission is to really, at the core, help women become more satisfied in their own lives, in their own selves, in their own skin, so that they're actually a more enjoyable energy to be around. They're happier, they're more fulfilled, and they're not relying on you men to fill this empty void that actually can't be filled by anybody but themselves. Now, how I do that is I put on women's circles, I do large-scale empowering events for women, I give them a lot of tools and techniques and experience of being embodied in their feminine and some amazing transformational tools that help them actually self-pleasure, self-satisfy, and self-satiate so that they're not so reliant on you or anyone else for their happiness. Sound good so far? Good. Keep, keep watching. So, I've been marketing to women for a very long time and usually one of the things that I come up against the most is, well, I don't have a supportive husband so I can't take the time off to, to come, uh, my business is, is you know, demanding too much of me, or what do you mean fun, play, pleasure, that sounds very fl frivolous and I'm really actually more committed to actually just taking action in the world and getting things done. Well, what I want to invite you men to do, because your well-being is directly related to every single woman on this planet's well-being. And I know that when they're happy, you are happy. And your whole mission is to help women become happier in some form or another, at least the women you love. And I've been inviting these women to come to my events and many say yes and come and they see massive transformation in their lives and the men in their life benefit greatly. But then I had an idea because I'm like, well, wait a second, actually, you guys out there are the ones that actually feel it the most when your woman is unhappy. I just had a lunch with two of my dearest girlfriends and they're married to two of my dearest man friends and they, we, <laughs> they were talking about where their men aren't stepping up and doing more to support them. And what I realized was that they're actually not doing enough to support themselves. And therefore, they're having men that can never win, it's never good enough, and they're just downright bitchy to their men. Now, in the end, they work it out and it, and it gets resolved, but really there's an edge and a layer of dissatisfaction. So to a man being in relationship with a woman where there's a layer of dissatisfaction, it's, it's a big blow to you. It's not supportive, it doesn't feel good, and it doesn't actually make you want to step up and do any more, as I stated just a second ago. But the women don't necessarily realize that they need an experience to help them step outside of that and actually become more amazing within themselves.
And this is where you come in. I really want to invite you this Valentine's Day, this month, any birthdays that are coming up, whatever. I'm, I'm actually probably you're watching this on Facebook because I've invited you to a Facebook event to actually step up and buy a ticket for Fun, Fabulous and Feminine live experience for a woman in your life and help her rediscover the power of who she is from a joyful, pleasure-filled, self-satiated way. So that she can actually shine that bright light that you see, be that radiant woman that you know her to be as often as possible. And stop being so caught up and beat down and upset about her life in whatever way, shape, or form she might be at times that really affects you. So where she may not have the wherewithal to give to herself because she's really caught in a particular uh, dogma or a way of being that actually doesn't see the value in this event, I think that if I could tell you guys that she's going to come back from this event feeling radiant, looking radiant, being more in her body, feeling sexy, feeling in love with herself and her life, that's going to have an effect on the kind of relationship you have. Now again, if you're a lover of this woman, you're going to get a lot more intimacy and a lot more availability for this woman because she won't be so depleted and drained at the end of the day. If you're in business or in some sort of working relationship with this woman, you're going to have a lot easier of a time getting things done because she's going to feel better about herself and not be second guessing everything and trying to sort of tear things down or being in too much in control. She's going to allow you to contribute. If this is a mother or a daughter of yours, you're going to see her shine in her life, in her business dealings, in her relationship dealings, in her relationship to her body, in the way she eats and nurtures herself. I mean, there's a lot here. Either way, you win. You win. Because when mama happy, everybody's happy. But when mama ain't happy, nobody's happy. But how can we help women become happier beings in general? Well, it does take a specific type of experience. It does take gathering with other women. And it does take an understanding of what I'm going to be teaching at Fun, Fabulous, and Feminine to really shift out really more naturally and with less effort to actually be the women that they want. And I can go on and on about what I teach there, but I don't think you actually care about the details because you're men, you're like, what's the problem, what's the point? The problem is women are unhappy and they're taking it out on you. The point is I want to support them and I need your support. And I would love for you to encourage a friend, buy a ticket for a friend, a lover, a mother, a sister, and just get them to fun, fabulous, and feminine. I believe, believe me, this will transform your life in so many ways. It'll transform everybody's life. So do your part. Um, support women in the ways they need to be supported. Either buy them a ticket or convince them, encourage them, spread the word, whatever you can do. But get as many women as you know and love who aren't really fully in their radiant self every day to this event. Everybody will love you for it. They'll love you for it. Do your part you'll get a lot more of everything from these women in the end. We'll all be happier. Okay? So who's in? Please just say, if you're, if you're going to buy somebody a ticket, join. Say, join this event. Say, I'm coming. Obviously, you're not going to come because it's a women's event. But put who, who it is that you're buying a ticket for, and we will sort out the details. You can go to funfabfem.com. That's short for fun, fabulous, and feminine. Funfabfem.com. Get a ticket for, for your lady friend, whoever it is, and you will see her life, your life, and everybody's life become so much brighter. All right. Thank you so much, guys, for hearing this message. I know it was long and windy. Thanks for sticking with me. And please, do your part. I will thank you, and you will feel so much better. All right. Take care. Bye-bye.